Gong and welcome to my kitchen. Today we're going to make elderberry champagne which is a fermented uh, drink from the elderberry flowers. It sits for two weeks to ferment with lemon and I'm going to show you how you do it and it's really nice in a warm summer to have this ice cold little frizzy drink. It's non-alcoholic so it's pretty good and so I'm going to go out and get the, the flowers to start with. Elderberry tree, just in case. The flowers should be sitting on and to make two jars I need about 30 flowers. Gorgeous. Uh -huh. So when I was out picking the flowers, I heated water and it's very important to use mineral water. I bought it for this uh, situation because if you use tap water, there might be a chance that the water has chlor and that's not going to ferment very well. So the warm water goes in and I'm preparing for two jars. I'm Melting the honey in the warm water. For the two jars, I need four tablespoons. So the flowers, you're not going to wash them because they have some kind of a substance that will ferment. And if you clean that off, it's not good. But just shake them off and make sure that there is no insects on them. So I have three well-washed lemons and three is enough for two jars. And we cut them into slices. lemon and a half for each jar and I'm gonna add the honey water for mineral water two tablespoons of white wine use a wooden spoon to move them around a little bit uh, don't use metal, the fruit can oxidize. This is now going to rest for two weeks and after two weeks you filter it and pour it on bottles and then you let the bottles sit again for about two weeks and you need to burp the bottles once in a while so make, make sure you do that. You close the bottles with very tight secure locks and don't use wine bottles with a cork because it might pop. Use either a screw or a secure top but you need to open and let it burn once in a while. now past four weeks of fermenting of the cordial and I'm gonna try it. Uh, first a little a bit of a taste. Just plain. Mm, it's good. Then I'm gonna do two drinks. Uh, for my girlfriend Karina and me. And I'm gonna make them, I'm gonna make them different. Uh, one is gonna have a dash of Prosecco, which is nice and cold. 
The other one is gonna have um, frizzy water. I think that's that's about it. And let me try it first before I serve her. Karina is my best friend from America and we haven't seen each other for a long time. So it takes a celebration that we're here together. Skål! Skål! Skål. Oh, delicious! Let's change. Ooh. Okay, change. <laughs> I want to try the one with water. Mm. I like the water. You li I like the, I like the water. I like the water. I like the water, but this is really good too. <laughs> so we're sitting in, we call it the Sunset Garden, uh, because we always end up here for um, aperitivo, because it's the highest point in the garden, and we have a beautiful sunset in front of us. So in it's nice. Yeah. yeah. And I thank you for watching this video and I hope I see you next time and arrivederci!